Young footballers all over the world dream of playing for their favourite clubs. These aspiring players idolise their heroes and aspire to follow in their footsteps. Whether it's Barcelona, Manchester United or Real Madrid, these young talents dream of showcasing their skills on the biggest of stages. But you'll be shocked to hear about the dream clubs of these emerging youth icons, starting with the fascinating story behind rising sensation Jude Bellingham. A classmate recently shared some incredible entries from their school leavers book. On one particular page, a young Bellingham wrote a header that said, When I grow up, I want to be... And guess what he wrote? He wrote that when he grew up, he wanted to be a professional footballer for Barcelona and England. But as fate would have it, the possibility of him joining Real Madrid is increasing with each passing day. It's a twist that adds an extra layer of intrigue to Bellingham's journey towards his dream club. And let me tell you about another incredible story. This time, it's about Kravac Scalia. Despite playing exceptionally well for Napoli this season, his dream club has always been Real Madrid. Even as a child, along with his siblings, he supported Madrid and openly expressed his desire to play for Los Blancos in the future. He also revealed that his biggest dream is to play for Madrid and win the Champions League. Moreover, he has been a devoted Madridista since his early days, watching their games with his brothers. His agent, Mamuka Jugeli, acknowledged that while he would be happy to see him in a Barcelona shirt, Farage Gelia is a proud Madridista who possesses the talent to play for any team in the world. Speaking of Barcelona, did you know that Vinny Jr. was a Barca fan? In an interesting revelation, former Barcelona scout for Brazil Andre Curie disclosed that the talented wide forward Vinicius was once on the verge of joining Barcelona. Curie shared on a Spanish TV show that Vinicius used to be a true fan of the Blaugrana, even shedding tears of joy when Barcelona staged a remarkable comeback win against PSG. On a different note, there is another player who finds himself competing for a rival team instead of his dream club. Karim Adeyemi his footballing path took a twist when he first started playing for TSV Forsten Reed as a youth. At the age of eight, he made his way to the renowned Bundesliga club FC Bayern Munich. However, negotiations didn't go as planned, resulting in Adeyemi having to leave Bayern. This turn of events led him to find a new home at SPVGG Unterhaching in 2012. Ultimately, he landed in Germany, but not at his dream club, but at their rival club Borussia Dortmund. It's an interesting turn of events, seeing Adeyemi now competing against the team he once aspired to join. Prepare to be surprised once again, as the next player dream club is not what you might expect. Contrary to popular belief, Mbappe's dream club is not Real Madrid but AC Milan. In an interview with La Gazzetta dello Sport, Mbappe revealed his special connection with AC Milan. As a child, he spent time with an Italian nanny and her family who were all passionate AC Milan fans. This influenced Mbappe to cheer for the Rossoneri and watch their games. He even mentioned that if he were to play in Italy, it would only be for AC Milan. There's another player whose dream club might not be widely known amongst fans, and that's Rasmus Hoyland. Although Hoyland has been linked to various clubs worldwide, he has previously confessed his admiration for Manchester United. He emphasised that he is a devoted fan of the Red Devils, however, he also made it clear that he wouldn't disregard interest from other top teams. His affection for United could potentially play a role in any potential transfer. Likewise, in December 2022, Mikhailo Mudrik initially showed an inclination towards Arsenal in a video posted on his Instagram story. The video captured him watching Arsenal's Premier League match against West Ham at the Emirates Stadium. However, in January 2023, things took a surprising twist as Mudrik made a move to Chelsea. Talk of Chelsea, there's a youth icon who was impressed by the club's legacy, especially players like Drogba and Lampard. It turns out that Jadon Sancho has been a secret admirer of Chelsea. This admiration stems from the exceptional era of Frank Lampard and Didier Drogba when Chelsea seemed unstoppable. Sancho has always had a soft spot for the Blues and he idolised Lampard in particular. He greatly appreciated Lampard's skills and the way that he played the game, direct, composed and with finesse. Similarly, in his standout season in the Premier League, Moises Carcedo caught the attention of top clubs like Chelsea, Liverpool and Arsenal. The Gunners even had a £70 million bid rejected in January. However, the midfielder recently disclosed his ultimate aspiration to join Real Madrid and lift the Champions League trophy. Lastly, Josko Gvardiol, a recently esteemed young defender, has been garnering immense praise worldwide in recent years. 
His impressive performances at the World Cup last year only added to the excitement surrounding him with reports suggesting that Liverpool and Real Madrid are both interested in acquiring his services. Currently playing for RB Leipzig, Vardiol is under contract with the German club until 2027, making any potential transfer a costly endeavour. When asked about his childhood dream team, Vardiol couldn't contain his excitement and confessed that it would definitely be Liverpool. He added that he used to watch countless Liverpool matches with his father and followed each season closely. Well, it does ring a bell, Klopp. So there you have it. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. Stay tuned for the next one. Goodbye.